Hello, my name is Kate May, Modern Day, blah, blah, Modern Day Mystic. Thank you for joining me on my YouTube channel. Here is your month of November tarot readings. We're going to kick off with Aries. Let's have a look, Aries. What's going on around for you? I am using my new deck. This is just the sample deck. They'll be ready very soon. Astro Tarot. Okay, you start the week off, Aries, month off, Aries. November, you're moving into karma water. There's a transition around you, Aries. Now, you may have been feeling that you've got lots of ideas, lots of things you want to do, but you've been blocked by them for some reason. It's almost like one step forward, one step back. So you may find that you're actually reevaluating things and you're thinking, I don't know if I want to go down that path. I don't know if I want to do that. So changes in the air for you, Um Aries this month. It's really important that you allow friends to support you and teammates to support you and reach out for some help. As much as you want to know everything and you want to be able to do everything, you actually can't do everything here. So this is saying that get people involved and people that are going to match your energy here, the three of pentacles. So what it's indicating is that you're going to be working in a team or collaborating with everyone that's equal around you. That's really important for you to move on. You are actually moving on into karma waters and you do have some new energy. Let me just show you the cards here. So first of all, we have the teammates card. So it's important that you rely on others or you get some help and support in. You're moving into karma waters. So there's a transition that's going to make things easier this month for you. Even if you're unsure where you're heading, you're still going to have a blend of calm that's coming. As the month unfolds, though, once you recognise what you want to leave behind, you've then got new ideas coming in. Initially, your mind might be a little bit muddled around you. You've got some ideas, you've got some goals that you want to reach, but this is a bit of a challenge for you. Keep going with it because there will be a breakthrough. Um, as you come to the end of the month, there's going to be a bit of a breakthrough a moment. But you've got the devil here, so be careful that you don't allow situations to become um, over unhealthy behaviours really, but also that you don't allow them to take over your life in an unnecessary way. So you could be blocked by something that ends up being um, quite a negative influence around you. But you have that Ace of Swords there that allows you to cut through that. Now you're going to have a choice this month, Aries, whether to allow this situation to keep blocking you, keep going forward and back and forward and back, or to break through from the situation. If you have anything that's controlling around you, it's not good at all. But equally your mind could could end up playing some tricks on you and saying that you can't do this, you can't do that. So there's this month of energies that you're really going to have to think about your thoughts and how you can change those. The transition that's coming in around you, Aries, may be a little bit uncomfortable, maybe a little bit painful, but rest assured that light is at the end of the tunnel. You are going to be able to get back on track of things. Keep that mindset that you're your top dog, Aries. Keep that mindset that you can work through these challenges. Now, the Eight of Swords comes up as one of your outcome cards. So where there's a will, there's a way. You really could allow your mind to block you. So be careful what you think. We are what we think. A falsehood of trappings here, playing the victim or being a little bit poor me may come in around you this month, Aries. But where there's a will, there's a way. So it's really important that as much as you're um, making your mind think blocked energies, you're also allowed to make your mind unblock that as well. The answer card, which indicates the general vibe of what you need to be doing or the answer to the situation, is reaching out for teammates. Collaborating, working within a group, small group, and reaching out and getting that help and support that you need. There could be a really good project or a really good venture coming up for you, but you're not going to be able to manage it easily on your own because of the way that your mindset is working there. So teammates are really important for you this, this month, Aries. And breaking through things. Do know that you're moving. Do know that there's transition, but it's going to be much better for you. Even if you doubt yourself, you doubt the situation. And there you have the six of wands. So victory and success can be yours once you figure out how to work, rewire that brain of yours. Victory and reaching important milestones is on the next next chapter up for you, Aries. If you want to book a personal reading for yourself, just contact me on www.katemay.co.uk.